What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another All of the Mods 9 Minecraft video. My name is Joshy Chichi, and to... Is that a creeper wearing a leprechaun hat for St. Patty's Day? What in the world? <laughs> that is pretty cool. Anyway, so today... I'm going to grab out this iron out of here and throw it into my iron chest. Today we're going to uh, just do some more resource collecting. Um, I have to remind myself that I do have the bunny hoppers on so I can just jump down. So yeah, um, we're going to do some more resource collecting today. I just remembered I have a... I need to turn my headphones down. Hold on one second. It's so loud. You gotta just turn the music down. That's options. I need music and sounds. Music can be 70. That's still so loud. Anyway, um, today we're going to continue with the resource collection. Um, like I said, I do have the, uh, I think I have the other waystone set up in the, um... goodness gracious, my phone is, <sighs> anyway. Um, in one of these places, and that should provide us with an opportunity to go down and, um, I just now remembered that I probably need to make some more pickaxes as well. Um, resource collection. Yes, that's what I was saying. Um, we need to continue with the resource collection. Um, and we also need to start looking for a place for us to inevitably go to as a base so one two do this throw you in there with those okay now what am i doing again waste on mine area there we go <laughs> yes okay so we're down here in the um, in the deeps with the aim of trying to collect more materials, uh, particularly stuff like um, diamonds and things of that nature. I'm not entirely sure which way I was going. Um, I think this way is a cave. All right. The pier shake, yeah, that's going to be this cave. So if we technically just go out this way, can I, hold on, I want to try something. Um, there we go. Okay, so let's go this way. Next to this is ink. Because why not? We'll go out this way and we'll uh, cut through, because I do see some amethyst right there, and that would be pretty, pretty useful to have. And then we'll do this right here, and we'll just kind of keep rolling through. So the entirety of this series is pretty slow formed um it's gonna take some time to kind of get to a good point but finding the uh finding a place to build to set up shop is going to be kind of uh kind of important as we're going to need more space for the storage solution that we're going to be building the power solution that we're going to be building um I don't know what that... Uh, is that a baby zombie? I don't like baby zombies. <laughs> uh, that is indeed a baby zombie. <laughs> I'm not going that way. <clears throat> Sorry, I don't like baby zombies. They're, they're annoying. They're mean. Anyway. Um, so yeah, we're going to need a lot of space uh, and hope Hopefully we can get to the mining dimension sooner rather than later. We do need to find ourselves some enough diamonds to be able to make a diamond pickaxe so we can create our nether, um, then find some netherite scrap so we can create a netherite pickaxe, and then find some all the modium, which in the overworld is pretty much going to be in the deeper dark which is a lot lower than where we're at now. Um, I could, in theory, start 
a uh, blockade going down or a, a staircase going down, um, which I might actually do here soon, just so I can at least try to find, try to even see if that we're in a we're in a place where there's possibility of having. Oh goody. Oh goody. That was that would be a far drop. Oh wait, I have bunny hoppers. <laughs> Let us cause I don't think typically there's nothing in the uh um typically there's nothing that will sp that spawns in here. These are pretty much like a um closed off areas. Which isn't always the case, because it looks like there is actually an opening right there with some diamond. Or not diamond, gold. Oh. Well, there is diamond right there. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Oh, there's a wide opening over here, too. Hmm. What's that? Deep slate sal ammoniac ore. Interesting. I'm curious if I can hit this from here. Ha-ha! <laughs> I don't have fortune, so that does pose a little bit of a problem. And it appears like, um, okay, so Z, I need to change that. Z is why my thing keeps changing. So let's do category R's. We're going to take Z off and X off. Done. So now we can, because I have it set to my mouse button and I can pretty much control that from here. So not a problem. Okay. Anyway, so let's, um, are those archeology span things? They are, they're urns. What did I get out of that? Some ash. That's pretty much it. Okay. Hmm. This place is definitely, uh, a potential for us being able to find the deep dark. If we're lucky, we sh we might be able to find it in this uh, close to the, close to here. We just gotta do a little bit of re uh, adventuring and looking around and stuff. I'm trying to get as much ma as many mage light as. As mini mage light? As much mage light? Hey, some diamond. Very nice. Saves the uh, capability of my pickaxe. as I use it. So really there's, I'm only seeing bats and stuff like that. So for now, at least, um, this of course will change. I'm very certain of it. Um, big thing that we will need to do probably pretty soon is, uh, look for ways to upgrade our, uh, um, our mana capacity. Cause we have very limited mana right now. 
Okay, so I do see a spider over there. All right. See more diamonds up there. I do you like that? I don't think I can get the... I'm curious, can I do... Will this actually work for the... It will not, okay. Hello. <laughs> Redstone is helpful. All right, so... A lot of lava. I do, do like the amount of lava there is. What is that pink one? Hello, diamond. Well, um, a bat just died. <laughs> That's awkward. What's over here? I'm being very cautious just because of the fact that I really don't feel like dying right now. What was I what was I looking at a second ago? Um was it that stuff? Maybe. Might have been. I don't know. I don't remember. What is that? What are those? Oh, there's a skeleton right there. Well, that's not just a skeleton. That's an that's a mean boy. <laughs> it's funny that I can shoot him with my light like that, and he doesn't really do anything. What are those that are? Not entirely sure what that stuff is. Okay. Let's take a look sees over here, see what we got. Um, let's see. Don't actually remember what this stuff is. Okay, so some pink stuff over there. There's I, what I assume to be diamond right there. It's, uh, yeah. Now, is this capable of being broken? No. Okay. So that requires some hefty ore. Or some hefty, uh, stuff. Let's see here. I assume this is... Oh my gosh. These guys are fast. Oh, there's a... I'm just going to block myself in here for a second. <laughs> Get this guy scared from this. Ow, ow.
How did that happen? What? Excuse me, moi? Oh, I need the uh, the light. So that's ex that's interesting. That's exciting. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. That's how it works, right? It's just everything just decides to go kind of haywire immediately as soon as I try to do something. Now my question is, can I go this way and mine under them and get away? <laughs> we'll see. We'll see how far out this goes. And if they even follow me. See, this is how you efficiently escape from the annoyances of um, um, mobs that you did not realize you couldn't beat. <laughs> It does appear that it is working to a degree, so that's good. Because they are kind of staying over there, so. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, so we'll, uh, maybe I can go down a little bit. Because um, we're only at Y19 right now. So maybe I can start going down a little bit. More towards the, um... lower Y level and see about possibly possibly getting to a level that might be the deep dark everybody's gonna give me a hard time why are you mining diamonds like that nobody mines diamonds like that especially in a vein you have to break all the blocks apart so none of the diamonds fall into the lava i'm sorry i'm just so used to already having diamonds <laughs> i will do this just for you guys though what is this what is this stuff almond dinor pyrope what are those I don't know. See, no, no lava. We're good. We're fine. Beautiful. See, we're up to 18 diamonds. That is such a move. My ant spray is not working. It rained a lot over the past couple of days, too. So. Grand. Wait, what? Deep Slate Sapphire Ore? That's pretty cool. Huh. We'll just keep going down. It's gravel. Why is it like, why, I don't understand why that is like that. Is it like, is there lava close? To, I mean, I see the lava over there to my left. This stuff right here, but that's nowhere near me. Why is it like acting like there's lava right on the other side of these blocks? I don't understand. I might be just think thinking too much into it. And what's even crazier is the lava is actually on this side, but I'm seeing the uh, the orange like hot like ring or uh, highlight around on this side over here, which I don't know. I don't know. I have no idea. I don't know what's going on. I'm just over here trying to escape the mobs that are inevitably trying to kill me, while also trying to find. The deep dark. <laughs> Let's see. You actually gonna tell me where? No. 
I thought they had like a um I thought they added the uh um what's it called? Uh, you can find this at this location. Hey diamond. Cool. Now you can find it at Y level this. Maybe that's only for ores that are actively already in the game. I don't know. How many more? I have two more. Okay, that's fine. Beautiful. Just what I love to see. big is this vein going to be? What do you guys think? Not that. It's just four. That's good. Beautiful. Okay, we're up to 22 now. It'd be great to get ourselves some more um, some fortune put on this uh, diamond pickaxe or another eight pickaxe or whatever. I'd love to, love to be able to get um, more per yeah, we'll get there. It's fine. Now, I don't think we're going to find any... I don't think we're going to find the deep dark here. I think this isn't a place where the deep dark is going to be. So what I'm thinking I could do here is... Let me light right there up. We'll open the journey map up, but I'll take a look at what's the surrounding areas. So... With how deep we are, we're roughly about negative 40-ish right now. Oh, yeah. Negative forty what? Negative forty five. Um, I, that was weird. Um, what I'm thinking is, this is about the area that we would get, kind of noticing the deep dark. I'm not seeing anything here that would be deep dark ish, esque. So probably what we could do is just start mining like south because we're we're right here. If we mine south. And just keep going south. We should, you know, open up more area down here. And that could help. So we don't actually have to do any, go any further. We should be able to find it. I'm not going to say rather easily, but conveniently enough. And yes, I know my waystone is nowhere near me. Um, I do have the home command. Um, I don't have a back command. I don't, I think the back command doesn't, isn't activated in this one. Yeah, um, so I'll just have to figure another way out. But if we don't find it by the time that I break all my pickaxes or, or get close enough to be able to kind of see something, we should be able to hear it too because the deep dark has a terrifying sound compared to other caverns. Plus the, uh, you know, typical deep dark stuff. Okay, bat. All those guys are above me. So... Pretty easy. You just if you can't go through them, go under them, right? <laughs> yeah, I like that. I'm already bored of this. <laughs> I mean, we've, we've made a little bit of a, of a pathway here. I'm just trying to see if I can kind of see anything that would resemble a deep dark. What is the... Uh, come on. Typically negative one, negative 52. Generate around negative 52, so head down that level and start mining or caving until you see skulk. Okay. 
Maybe I was wrong. I need to go about 10 blocks down. Not a problem. Let me start that right here. <laughs> Look at this. We'll get to Y negative 52 and see if there's a possibility of something there. If not, then I mean, it's not a problem. All right, it's helpful though. I won't complain about getting this. We still have one more pickaxe left. Technically, yeah, we still have one more pickaxe left. Right, 48, 49, 50. So this will be 52. Right here. Beautiful. Which, in theory, it shouldn't show me really anything. Um, like this is all uh, deep, ca uh, deep caves region. Um, it's not actually showing me anything beneficial here. Whatever. We'll just kind of keep going. I'm not entirely sure what that negative 4 next to Y negative 52 is. If any of you guys have any idea why it's adding a negative four to it, I, I'm not gonna. Com I won't complain if you guys want a dark stone. there eventually. <laughs> oh, I forgot I had this in this one. I thought this was in the other one. Um, what is that? Red Almondine, Raw Pyrope, Raw Sapphire, Osmium. Obtained by mining Sal can be used in sal ammoniac accumulator to rapidly create sal ammoniac to be used as a solvent. Okay. Um, don't actually know what you are. Fluorite's helpful. And scrambled eggs. <laughs> helpful, right? some dark stone here, which dark stone takes a little bit longer than deep slate to mine. Eh, about the same actually. Quest completed? What? what quest did I complete? Welcome to Forbidden and Arcanus. Forbidden and Arcanus adds new ways to get better armor and chance and more. The magic themed mod has amazing animations as well as some overpowered items like Eternal Stella. Oh! So this is where the dark stone comes into play. Okay. Interesting. Not 100% sure what we're going to be doing using that for, but we will see what we can use it for. Um, it's not actually showing me what the items are. Okay, anyway. Yeah, one times. What is this? I swear I thought that said ancient debris. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> oh, I don't have any, um, hmm. Hold on. 
What? What? <laughs> Turns into arcane scalv sal salvage. Salvage. Empty upgrade orb. Oh. So that'll be useful later on down the road, I assume. I genuinely thought that said ancient debris for a second. I was like, why? <laughs> That's an odd place to put you, but it's it's arcane debris. Or as I call it in all the mods eight, arcane debris. Cannot believe the debris has gone and done the debris things. We'll just keep going down this way. Pop that on top of there, because why not? Uh, deep slate silver ore, okay. Sheesh. Alrighty then. This is fun. You guys enjoying yourselves? You guys having a good weekend so far? Or do you guys have a good weekend? Because this is going live on a Monday, so the weekend's already over if you're watching this. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, that's, that's just... Okay, I thought that was an opening. This dark stone is going to be the death of me. In real life, not, not in game. More redstone. Thank you, thank you. Urinate, urinite, no. uranian, uraninite, uraninite, uraninite. <laughs> I'm sorry, that just was a funny word. Okay, so there is lava over there. There's diamond right here. So obviously now I'm not going to just straight up mine it. I'm going to dig it out to make sure there's no lava around it. I know I probably should be um, saving some of that for uh, when I have a fortune pickaxe, but I need um diamonds soon that is the most terrifying noise so you're just mining and you just hear that you're gonna think freaking a monsters or a mob is like right behind you about to attack you and take your lunch money goodness gracious let's see here I don't see anything beneficial. I really don't, I don't see any, like none of these like little cavern systems screams um, deep or dark to me. So, darn, it is unfortunate. Messed me up. I think by now I would have seen some skulks if I was going to be close enough to get there with my current pick. I do not believe I'm going to run into anything deeper dark related. So I don't think there is a deeper dark in this little system over here. A good thing to probably make, and I think I have enough resources to make one, unless I actually already have one. I might already have one. Wait, what? Raw diamond? Oh. Don't know what this does. Oh. 
So if I throw this into a smell... That's interesting. Um, more ways to get... Um, okay. So I think we're pretty much at, this, at a point where we're going to have to go back. But I, I, I genuinely don't see a way for us to get... Um, well anything out of that and really it's not a big deal if i don't get to the deeper dark soon because i need to go to the uh i need to go to the nether first to get ancient debris to get uh pickaxe what am i doing it's in here um to get the pickaxe to work but to show you this this is what's cool 36 of these each individual one will turn into a diamond so that means i have an additional 36 diamonds that's really cool I like that. That's nice. I do like that. Like that very much. Um. Throw this stuff in here. And then let's see what it takes to make a compass real quick. Keep trying to open my... Um, uh, nature compass. Compass is going to be four iron and redstone. So... One, two, three, four. And then redstone, which I think I just threw all my redstone back in here. Not all of it, but you know. Um, so we'll make our regular compass real quick. And then now we're going to need... I think it's logs. Let's just grab those. And then these. And that's sky stone. I think I have regular logs. Spruce planks. I guess not, actually. Hmm. I need saplings. Four saplings. Four saplings. I have saplings in here somewhere. These should work. One, two, three, four. I'm going to look for my uh, my other saplings first, though, just in case. Because I think I have oak saplings around here somewhere. I forgot I have one over here. Yes, duck oak saplings. Boom. Okay. No, not in there. Um, okay. Cool. So now we have a nature compass, which means we can search up the deep dark, which will tell us it is 1,360 blocks in that direction. So to put that into perspective, that is southeast. So that'll be this way. So the deeper dark will likely be probably like somewhere around like right here. But that's pretty much this episode. We did a lot. We, we found a, a decent amount of stuff. I thought that was pretty good. Um, next episode, we're going to make our, um, we're going to make our diamond pickaxe. And that is going to allow us the opportunity to be able to get our, um, uh, obsidian so that we can then make a flint and steel because we have flint and we have iron we'll make our flint and steel go to the nether get some ancient debris hopefully get a good nether spawn um but we'll see what happens in the next episode so we're trying to move through this somewhat quickly not like super quick not like terribly slow um but i definitely want to try to get a um netherite pickaxe soon so i can find some olimodium and hopefully do something about uh, that teleport pad so we can get the mining dimension kind of set because the mining dimension is going to be pretty or the teleport pad is going to be pretty simple to make once we can find a singular um, automodium ingot because we have an ender pearl right here. So really, it's not going to be that difficult. And then finding the fortress is going to be you know pretty simple as well. So there's going to be a lot of things that we're going to do quickly. Um, I just have to continue kind of getting as much diamond as possible. And I think in the next episode, because I do have a lot of diamond, I should be able to make full diamond, diamond armor. But we'll do that here in the next episode. But thank you guys so very much for watching. Hit that subscribe button if you're not already. Hit that like button if you haven't. If you didn't enjoy the video, leave a comment down below. Let me know what I could do better to make these videos more uh, entertaining for you guys to watch. But with that being said, thank you guys so very much again for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.